people welcome back to some more vitamin y so today is thursday and that means that we are using cosmic Bell. so uh cosmic Bell, uh, like i said i'm planning on taking it off soon of course we have three decks in the lineup uh you already saw red eyes you bell on uh web handles and if you haven't seen it already make sure you go see that but uh you know we have red eyes you bell in the lineup that's you know wants to join the battle uh umber you bell which of course hasn't got a chance to be seen but you know I, I kind of feel like out of the three decks, Umber Yubel, Red Eyes Yubel, and uh, Evil Hero Yubel, I kind of feel like Umber Yubel might have the most synergy, just, you know, because there's a lot of monsters with zero defense that are dark, so, you know, they'll have more synergy and go next seas and uh, better. So it's, it's, it's closer to, like, more like a, a rank 4 deck, a rank 4 spam deck, but, you know, it still has plays and synergies with Yubel. Uh, you will see the return of an old, old, old card that I haven't ran in the Yubel deck in forever. But you will see the return of that card, so you'll be like, oh wow, that, that's a blast from the past. Um, what else? What else? Uh, Evil Hero you Bell. Um, I still haven't tested that deck. I made it, but I haven't tested it. And I don't know, I feel like it might come across a, just a little bit shaky. Uh, I'm gonna take it a little slow. I don't care if he, I don't care if he spaces some, some of this. It's better than him spacing you know, other cards, so uh, you can go ahead and have it. Let's take it off slow. I'll go ahead and, you know. Set the B on. Go ahead. You go ahead and attack into it. I don't care. You know, maybe summon a you know a Jiao to you know summon a Goyo Guardian. Why not? You know. Also, uh, if you guys aren't watching Arc Five, if you haven't seen freaking Goyo King, yeah, that card's busted. That card is busted. So magical mallet in like a sixty card deck. Okay. So one. One. Really, nigga. One. One, you want to you want to neg with magical mallet for one fucking card? Wow. Okay, I guess. Okay, do do your thing. I mean, you're already looking mighty inconsistent there. Then you're gonna go ahead for one fucking card. Like, really, nigga? One. Ah. <sighs> anyway, uh. It will hear you, Bell. Like I said, I made it. And is that a dark effigy? Yeah, it is. All right. Well, you go ahead and kill me. I will go ahead and get my effect on it. I'm summoning it in defense position, right? Yeah, defense position. Whatever their stat is zero, that's the position that I summon it in. You gotta be, you know, used to that by now. So we'll go ahead and summon Geo, of course. Draw. Hmm, Swanee. Oh my God. I could actually revive Beyon, summon Sawani, and go into the powerful Chao Fang. But, of course, you know, Chao Fang is super susceptible to back row, so. So, I'm sure you can have it. Okay. Um, and this Synchro Summon card is destroyed on here. I can add one tuner from my deck to my hand. Okay. What per turn? When a monster, my opponent. I can I can summon one best position who's original, okay. Hmm. Should I just go for Goyo Guardian or should I actually just go ahead and push with Chao Fang? You know what, let's have fun. Fuck it. Let's go ahead and go into Chao Fang. So I have to activate your call haunted or waste. So I'll go ahead and activate Call of the Haunted. Yeah, uh you will hear you bell, you know. Uh, everyone's are tuning your heroes, the one that go likes to go ahead and be what? Malicious Edge and I think a, like a level 6 or higher fiend type monster, i.e. you build of course, and I run other fiend type monsters. And um, the one that's a fiend type monster plus uh, a rock. So it runs fiend type monsters like I said before, and then the rocks are actually the go 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 ga 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 rock engine. You know, that has decent beaters and of course one of them has zero defense, so Mass Chameleon has synergy. So uh, that's pretty much... Out of the deck, uh, I'm trying to run it. You know, uh, when I made it for him, I didn't really know much about evil heroes, so I wanted to go ahead and uh, at least try my best when it came to that deck. Chao Fang. Uh, Asua, I bet. Chao is 3300. And we'll just have Chao Fang go ahead and attack. Yeah, that mirror force. Oh, you're just gonna bottomless me on summon. 
All right, sure. <clears throat> and I think it says when this card is destroyed, sent to graveyard, doesn't it? Yep, sent to the graveyard. Oh, that sucks. Fucking 50, 60 card deck gets bottomless. Like, number generator is still. Even with a 60 card deck, it still works. Like, it's fucking magic. It's like, wow. Magic. <laughs> I'll go and summon some Gia back. I guess. I don't know. Maybe I'll go into a guard Goyo Guardian. I want Beyond. Like, I really want Beyond. Yep, this will go ahead and summon Armageddon Knight. Armageddon Knight, go ahead and send you Bell in case shit hits the fan, because it seems like it might. I need to look over that deck again. It seems like it's not correct. Synchro Shulkan. Into. Goyo. Once we turn this card to destroy battle, it's just too trippy. Alright, let's just kill you. Okay, it's getting really annoying. Go ahead. 60 card deck and still back rowing the living shit out of me. It's fine. Mm hmm. So you on Synchro Summon? You're a tuner, right? You can Synchro Summon. You're gonna have to secure something to get over me because no one's strong enough to go. I mean, are you just gonna go the defensive route? Okay, you can secure summon. You can exceed summon. You have plays. You don't have to back down and go to defense mode. Okay, so you're gonna go into Utopia. Really, nigga? It's clearly not how you do it. <laughs> what the fuck was that? You wanna try that again? It's fine. It's fine. It's Yeah, I think it's the bell, you bell button time. So we're actually gonna get you bell involved in, in this duel. If you did it wrong again, okay, you got it. All right, you bell time. Into defense. Perfect. We'll go ahead and summon tear. I'll actually, summon this because I went in the graveyard anyway. Perfect. <clears throat> so, gotta call the haunted. So maybe I can use that with one of the young zings. For upcoming plays right now, maybe I'll go ahead and turn this terror into an ult nightmare. Depends. Depends on how many, how many, what plays he does and how many cards he has left. There is no effect. What effect? What effect? What are you talking about? There is no effect. By battle. So. <laughs> so that once we turn this card cannot be destroyed. It's by battle. So it's clearly right there. It's in the sentence. So how are you going to deal with Ebel? You're not. You're just going to set a monster. Alright. That's fine. Oh. Hands in creation. I could probably have fun with that. Especially with Terra. Alright. That kill your monster again. I'll pretty much just keep wiping until you stop setting shit. 
is you're you're just slowly gonna run out of monsters. You're gonna run out. Of, well, you're probably not a 60 card deck. Eventually, you're just not gonna draw a monster. I'm not gonna have to worry about your ass anymore. All right. Ah, Bixie. You guys know I love me some Bixie. Ah, uh, got Suwani. Go ahead and start getting some damage. And of course, this is another fucking magical cylinder, which gets to slap the living shit out of this man. So I'm gonna go ahead and activate Call the Haunted. Summon Suwani. Suwani attack. No, I don't want Suwani because I actually want to summon. Actually, you know what? You can summon Suwani for me. Another Suwani. You, Suwani. I want you to summon a Jialtu for me, and I'm gonna use this Bixie next turn to go into Abeels. Yeah, that seems like a fine idea. And a mill. Okay, that's fine. This is two. I'll go ahead and activate creation. Terror effect. So effect. Creation effect. So we will be summoning another Solani. And uh, Gia. Go. They could always just go ahead and turn Terror into Ultimate Nightmare with. Uh, what's his name? Nefarious Harsh and Nefariousness, but I don't say like it. I'd rather just sit on Terror, you know. Draw. And summon Bixie. Synchro Shokan. Deals, but I could go into freaking Baxia and bounce all three of them cards back to the deck. Like I said I can turn I can turn this into uh Nah. If I would have turned it into Ultimate Nightmare last turn, then I would have went into Bixie, but I really want to go ahead and lose three of my monsters just for nothing. Hey, you know what? Hmm. Trying to think. Really trying to think. Yeah, you know I'm going to back to you. Effect. Turn three cards to deck. One, two, three. That is twenty eight hundred. You don't have some kind of graveyard effect, do you? No. Yeah, I should have searched in an ultra nightmare last turn. Sucks that, you know, it's like during my opponent's end phase, whatever. Effect. Go. Creation effect. We'll go ahead and summon. I think I have one more Gia left. Yeah. We'll go ahead and summon this Gia. Go ahead. Because now since you have like no cards, I'm definitely gonna go ahead and hit the uh, what's it called? The archery button. Maybe synchro summon you and you and Toronto Mates. Wow. You actually gave my Ubel attack points. Wow. Alright. Uh, Nefa Fat. Terror Fat. Wow, Ashley's gonna give my Ubel some attack points. Thanks. <laughs> Thanks. Draw. So go ahead and. What do I do more damage with? This is 500 attack now. So those are 500 plus. It's not only 21. So our mateys would still. Going to our mateys would still be better. Yeah. Attack for 1500. Uh, 
Attack for 23. Oh, you're going to survive my 500. I want to kill you with you, Val. <laughs> yeah, I'm not sure if I can do it. 500? You feel so? <laughs> I'm sorry. Go ahead. The plane gets dark around. I'm like, oh, thank you for the attack. <laughs> you got that regeki? What did you do? I changed on the time. Dark monsters and girl. How many does he have? One, two, three, four, five. Oh, damn. He has five. So, uh, five more. You can send this card to the graveyard to destroy all face down monster opponent controls. I don't control any face down monsters. Said that game. <sighs> if I control the face down monster, then sure, but I don't, so. <laughs> the Chaos Hunter is 2100 for the Earfield spell. You can run over my uh, the Fairy Sarsha and the Fairy's Nest. That's fine, he served his purpose. That's it. I think this game is over, that's it. Wow, bye! <laughs> wow. So, of course, you know, kill this, I don't care. Next turn, I'm gonna draw Ultimate Nightmare attack again. So, I talk about how Yubel doesn't get involved with Cosmic Yubel, and Yubel putting that work in this duel, so. Because I drew that Armageddon, I just send Yubel. Like I said, I try to number generalize it up. You know, one Armageddon Knight, one Roto, one Foolish. Uh, I do the same in, uh, uh, excuse me, I do the same in Red Eyes Yubel. Which, I have a problem doing that just because I feel like Yubel is not being involved as much as, you know, running the multiple I'm again, Knights of Dark Reference, because you could send Yubel more often, but, eh. Anyway, I'm going to go ahead and call the episode of Vime and Y. So, I hope that you guys enjoyed. So, thanks for watching, thanks for all the support, and I will see you guys tomorrow with, of course, the leader of all the decks on Vime and Y, Super Vice Yubel. Alright, people, thanks for watching. <laughs>